All right, I'm in downtown Superior on the 1st of June. So it's been five months since the Marshall Fire. We haven't made a lot of progress. However, you can see, look at this. This is where my house used to be. So we are making a little bit of progress in regards to what we were able to do privately. We did get the lot cleaned up. We are still, Town of Superior has still issued one permit and only one. I apologize for the wind. It's rather windy. So one permit has been issued. We have gone almost to actually more than once a week trying to figure out what to do. We are looking at the graphs. We're doing literally everything the town is asking us to, yet it's still not enough. We were actually just denied a next app approval step because the printer printed out a brick that was slightly off from what we were actually purchasing. So in my opinion, that's shenanigans. We're getting the runaround big time and I just don't really know how to say it nicely or spin it to where I think it's appropriate. It's been five months. One permit, which was a photo shoot for what it's worth, occurred. That's it. So what, what's going on, town of Superior, town of Louisville? My house is six months old and you're giving me issues about my fourth bedroom that I had before my fire. I'm sorry, my house burned down and literally I lost everything. And now you're telling me that you're not going to approve the house that I had, that I had insured, and you're gonna reject a permit because the printer ink was the wrong color? It just doesn't make a lot of sense. It's just, I don't really know what's going on. And now I'm actually gonna to go to a town hall meeting um, in two days um, where they're trying to make changes. Oh, a little funny make changes to the downtown that was supposed to be this beautiful downtown with restaurants shops everything that is so nice and that for some reason they're making it a priority to change that when there's 22 homes that they're still like this we haven't seen any progress in regards to permitting or rebuilding being able to go back home they're trying to I don't know appease other people I suppose other people that are paying more than we did um, even though we paid kind of a high price um, in my opinion so that's our five month update I wish I had better news I would love to go home um, but I don't even know if that's an option at this point and we were fully insured which we're in the eight percent that was actually insured but even after the insurance hurdle which so many people are in so much pain right now because of the lack of insurance and lack of action that it just breaks my heart.